Hey guys, so today's video is going to be the winter tag. Um, this is called the winterlicious tag. I'm just going to call it the winter tag. But I am just so excited for winter, I just jumped right into the winter tag because technically it is still fall. But I was like, I mean, the Halloween tag is kind of like the fall tag. So I just stuck with the Halloween tag to count as the fall tag because I just wanted to jump into winter because my room is all decorated and it feels very very festive in here and I'm, I really like it it's really nice because let me just put these down I hung or I put up my Christmas tree as you can see right over there um, I put a little present under there because we don't have our Christmas tree yet we're actually getting it tomorrow and I'm going to vlog that um, unless if you guys don't want to see it, but if you do want to see a vlog, um, because this will kind of be the start of my vlogmas series, um, so if you do want to see a vlog, give this video a thumbs up. Anyway, so that's my little Christmas tree over there, and then I hung a little, I hung a little garland on my mirror, and I think it's super, super pretty and super festive, and I just, I just love it in here. I think it's like super cozy and, whoa, hello. So, yeah, I just wanted to get right into the Christmas spirit, and again, this is part of the series of It's Getting Chilly with Lily, so I will put this video and last video into that playlist, because I did create it, but I still gotta put the videos in. But, yeah, so without further ado, let's get on to the tag. The first question is, favorite winter nail polish? So, I have two right here. Um, the first one is OPI's... Um, extravagance, sorry, OPI's Extravagance Nail Polish. Um, I really think this is so pretty, like, for both winter and fall. It's just, like, this gorgeous, like, purpley, you can't really see in this lighting, but it has, like, little gold and silver glitter in it. You can kind of see it, but I love this nail polish. I think it's so pretty. And then I have the nail polish that I'm wearing right now. It's kind of chipping off. But it is the Sally Hansen Hard as Nails uh, nail polish in Golden Eye. Or Golden L. I don't know. Golden Eye L. But I think it's so pretty. I love gold and just burgundy colors for the winter time. So these are probably my two favorite winter nail polishes. Second question is favorite winter lip product. So again, I've got two here. The first one is kind of like a dark, vampy, berry lip. Um, and that for me is Wet n Wild's lipstick in Cherry Bomb, which is just like this gorgeous, dark, really pretty. It's almost like the color of my sweater right now. But, oh, and I love these lipsticks, like this whole line in general. And this lipstick is so flipping pigmented. And these are only like $2.00. And it's amazing. So that's that color there. So it's like exactly, it's like exactly my sweater color. But um, I either love this or I like just to go for just like a plain classic red. Um, the red lipstick I have is Clinique's Angel Red, which looks like this. And these are really pigmented as well. This one's more on the sheer side though, this lipstick. Um... But it comes off really pigmented on the lips. It kind of comes off more sheer on the hand. But on the lips it's super pigmented. And I like that lipstick because it's really glossy. And it kind of makes it any look look more glamorous. Um, so yeah, these are probably my two favorite lip colors for the winter time. Third question is most worn clothing piece. So I don't have to say the sweater. Um, I love this sweater. It's so comfy. It's it's kind of cropped. It's like a long crop top. Um, but And it has like these little slits on the sides. If you can kind of see that. Um, I love this sweater. It's amazing. I got it at H&M. I think it was like 12 bucks or something. And it's so cozy. And it's really soft. It kind of feels itchy on the outside. But on the inside it's kind of made more of like soft material. I love this sweater. I really do. Fourth question is most worn winter accessory. So I'm going to have to say either scarves or hats. 
So this scarf is um, the one that I had in my last video, and I I said it was from Ann Taylor Loft, but this is actually from H&M as well. Um, I don't know why I thought it was from Ann Taylor Loft, but it's just like a big, thick um, circle scarf, and I love this scarf because it's so thick, and it has like a million layers, and it keeps my neck so warm. It keeps me so warm, and it's just really cozy. Um... But I also wear hats a lot. Um, this is just like a normal little bee. Um, it's really fuzzy inside. But yeah, so I'm either going to have to say scarves or hat or beanies slash hats. Um, I love wearing these during the winter time. Fifth question is favorite winter scent slash candle. And you guys know it's my fresh balsam candle from Bath and Body Works. Oh. It smells so good. I love the smell of Christmas trees. This smells exactly like pine and Christmas trees. So if you love, if you love this, those smells, I definitely recommend this candle. It smells so amazing. And it just, it smells really fresh. And it's kind of like refreshing to me. So, Fresh Balsam by Bath & Body Works. Sixth question is, what is your favorite winter beverage? So mine is the Stevens Candy Cane Cocoa. This is so good. It says milk chocolate hot cocoa with real peppermint candy cane. So it has like little chunks of peppermint in it. I don't want it to spill. But if you can see the little white chunks in there, yeah. That's peppermint. It's so good. It just kind of like, because hot cocoa can be kind of rich and just like, like, I don't know, makes you, like, dehydrated, and, like, the peppermint in it kind of gives you more of, like, a refreshing kind of feel, if that makes any sense. Um, but it also gives the hot cocoa, like, a, like, a really good flavor. So I love and definitely recommend this hot cocoa. Seventh question is, what is your all-time favorite Christmas-slash-holiday movie? Mine would have to be The Polar Express. I love that movie, um, just because it has, like, really good memories with me and my grandma because we used to love to watch movies together during the Christmas time and she showed me that movie when I was like five maybe four or five or something and ever since then we've always watched it together every Christmas so I I, I love that movie just really it brings back a lot of um childhood memories and I really like that movie in general I think it's a really cute idea so yeah the Polar Express for me Eighth question is, what is your all-time favorite Christmas slash holiday song? Um, I'm going to have to go with Jingle Bell Rock because it has a nice tone to it. Or I really love Cold December Night by Michael Buble. That was um, the intro for my last video. I really like the beat and I kind of like, it's kind of relaxing. Um, so yeah, those are probably my two all-time favorite holiday songs. The ninth question is... Let me pull it up here. What is your favorite holiday food slash treat? So I'm going to go with treat for this one. My favorite holiday treat is those little Hershey Kisses. Um, like they have like different scents for the holidays. Or scents. Different flavors for the holidays. Um, I have two. I like the little um, ones with like the mint truffle in them. They kind of taste like Junior Mints but they're in Kisses form and they taste really good. I also like the peppermint bark ones. They have like white swirled with like peppermint bark and they're really good. So those would have to be my two favorite holiday treats. And the 10th question is, what is your favorite Christmas decoration this year? So I actually have three. I have two with me, but I do have three. I cannot decide which one is my favorite. So the first one is every year Starbucks comes out with like different kinds of ornaments slash like mugs that they have every Christmas. So this one um, I think was in holiday 2008. So this is from way back in 2008. We obviously have more. But I just think this would look the best with my room, I guess. Um, it's just this little mug and it looks like this. It has like little leaves on it. And we have the one with the red one, like the red cup and the little 
brown thing. And they came out with a new one this year where it's like with cold drinks where they have like the clear cup and then the little straw. They came out with those this year and we have that back there. I'm actually going to go get it for you guys really quick. Just hold on a sec. Here it is. It's still in its packaging. We haven't taken it out yet, but here it is. It's so cute. And here's the little straw. And then this is where you hang it up. But it's just like your traditional clear cold drink um, cup from Starbucks. And we got it this year and it came out this year. So I think this is absolutely adorable. So um, but the one that was hanging on my tree is this one, and I think it's super, super cute. The next favorite ornament I have is this one. Um, it's just like this little house. Um, we, me and my mom collect these little villages, um, and we like to put them on our dining room table for our decorations. Um, and she found this mini one, and it is so cute. So I wanted to hang it on my tree. She has like four of these, and they're adorable. But I really like this one. And it's just like a little cottage. It has a little Christmas tree with little ornaments on it and a little wreath. Uh, and that's pretty much it. And it's all glittery and festive and I love it. So yeah, those are going to have to be my favorite Christmas ornaments. The 11th question is, what is at the top of your wish list this year? So I really want some like makeup geek shadows. Because I have heard the hype, I've heard, I've seen them swatched, I follow her on YouTube, or I subscribe to her on YouTube, and they look so amazing. So I have a little list that, um, some shadows that I want. Um, but otherwise, I don't really want anything. Um, I just kind of want to be with my family and my friends, and I just want to have a good little holiday, and yeah, I'm not really asking for a lot this year, I don't know, but yeah. And the last question is, what are your plans for the holidays this year? So me and my family and our really close family friends, we all used to go to, um, we have like the zoo, and we call it the zoo lights, where, because like all the animals are hibernating and they're away for the holidays and so they bring out like these light up animals and it's kind of like you just follow this trail and you go through like all these animals and there's just lights everywhere and it's so it's really pretty um but this year I think we're just gonna kind of relax at home we haven't done that for one year of Christmas um at least that I've been alive I know I said for like we've done that for about eight years but we've done other stuff for the past years and I don't know what I can't remember but yeah this is going to be our first Christmas Eve that we're going to be relaxing um and yeah we're just going to sit at home we're going to bake cookies and watch Hallmark movies and pretty much that we're we just want to take it easy this year just because we've been really active for the past holidays so we just kind of want to take it easy this year but yeah so that was the Winterlicious tag. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And also thumbs up if you want a vlog, because, again, I'm going to probably get my Christmas tree either tomorrow or uh, Tuesday. Not too sure when, but yeah, so like that video if you want it to also be the start of my Vlogmas series. But, yeah, so I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye-bye.